The overall goal of this procedure is to isolate, characterize, and differentiate human dental pulp stem cells from permanent teeth by using two methods. This is accomplished by collecting healthy, impacted wisdom teeth, cutting them around cement to enamel junction. At the beginning, dental pulp stem cells, DPSCs, are isolated by two different methods. In the first method, pulp tissues are enzymatically digested by incubating in collagenase type 1 plus this phase solution. Here we call them ED considering the isolation method. In the second method, pulp tissues are only placed into the flask without any digestion. In this way, DPSCs begin to migrate from tissue into the flask. These cells named OG refer to the outgrowth isolation method. The second step of the procedure is the identification of stem cells using flow cytometry. The third step of the procedure is the induction of odontoblast differentiation. And the final step of the procedure is the comparative evaluation of odontoblast differentiation between two groups by alzheimer red staining and QPCR. I'm Razia Karamzadeh from Department of Stem Cells and Developmental Biology at Ryan Institute. Today I'm going to show you the isolation, characterization, and comparative differentiation of human mesenchymal stem cells by using two methods. Hello, uh, I am Dr. Reza Aflatunian from Ryan Institute. We are working on a project related to human dental pulp stem cells. These cells are kind of mesenchymal stem cells which are easy to obtain with minimum pain and